that you do it on purpose Sing like a sing-along key Talk to the girl that intimidates you Pretend that you're brilliant and charming I said pretend that you're brilliant and charming Hey! I can't believe that I put that down there. Why did you do that? <laughs> you can't give me a megaphone. This is going to be the whole show. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Hey, it, even ha it has a siren. I can't even. <laughs> All right. I'll put it down. Thank you. Thanks for tuning in, Lady with Jason Sewell. Thanks for being here. Uh, we are entertainment television with heart right here in Northwest Arkansas. You know, they asked me, they said, hey, we should do a live show. And I said, where are we going to have it? And they said, how about Walton Art Center? And I said, ooh, I don't passed know. passed out, actually. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And here we are. So give yourselves a round of applause. Again, I think it's worth pointing out that my great friend, my buddy, Jason Radcliffe over there leads our band. That's right. <laughs> a shout out to the band. Jason, Derek, Owen, Alicia, Charlie. Give a big round of applause for our band. Thank you. Thank you very much. And of course, Bo Count's joining me at the desk. How's it going, Bo? I'm good. How are you? <laughs> you doing well? Do yeah. you like that? I mean, it's a megaphone. Don't <laughs> tempt me. A little bit later in Walton Art Center season, there's going to be a show called Waitress. And Waitress is all about some pies. Has anybody seen the movie Waitress? It's an amazing movie. Any hands? There are. I've seen the movie Waiting. <laughs> and I don't know if that's appropriate for Steve. <laughs> Probably yeah. not. Yeah. Knowing the movies that you watch. Uh, <laughs> Waitress is going to be here at Walton Art Center. And we're going to be joined by local company Harvest Moon Pies, Ooh. who are going to create some pies for us. Round of applause for Harvest Moon Pies yum, joining yum. us in my program. I hear our great friend Turbo Dan is going to join us. Turbo Dan, round of applause for Turbo Dan. We might do a push up. Yeah. Yes. Fun. And then, of course, uh, we would be remiss if we didn't talk about Elaine's dance is going to come on and teach us some swing steps what? later on the show. A big round of applause for Elaine's dance joining us. Yeah. We're going to welcome uh, the guests to the show today. In just a minute, we're going to be visiting with one of the cast members, believe it or not, straight from Broadway, straight from New York an City. An actual famous person? An actual famous person, Whoa. Broadway star, who is starring in The Lightning Thief here at Walton Art Center, Sarah Beth Pfeiffer, give it up for Sarah Beth joining us on the show. Yes. So take a look at that interview right here. All right, everybody, welcome. We are joined by Sarah Beth Pfeiffer. Uh, so thrilled to have you here. Uh, Broadway actor, professional actor, uh, portraying the role of Clarice in The Lightning Thief that's coming to Walton Art Center this January. Thank you so much for being here. Yeah, it's great to be here. Awesome. So. Sarah Beth, I gotta ask, you were part of the original cast for The Lightning Thief off-Broadway. What is it like to bring something so iconic to the stage? Oh man, it's a lot of fun. I mean, uh, I think most of the cast read the book before we started working on the show, and I know the writers did. Um, and it's so beloved, the book series, um, by so many fans. And so it's actually just a huge bonus for us because there's this you know, if we do the books justice, which we like to think that we we do, it uh, it has this automatic built-in amazing fan base. Yeah. Do you find that the Percy Jackson fans, people who are fans of the novel, are particularly vocal or um, you know super interested? Oh, for sure. There's like a huge online fandom, um, and there's also sort of an interesting history with with the adaptations of the book because the movies are sort of famously not beloved by the fan base. Um, yeah, because so, uh, remember Pierce Brosnan, that scene? <laughs> Let's forget it. <laughs> yep, for sure. Um, 
So we like to think that we sort of have redeemed the adaptation right. of, of the book. What's your favorite part about uh, being a part of this production? Oh man, I mean, I've been with the show for so long. Yeah. I was a part of one of the very first workshops of it five years ago. So to have seen it through so much, to see the writers develop it, um, you know, I, some of my best friends now are, you know, members of the cast that are going on the tour. So, you know, it's not every gig where you have such a sort of like family already built into it. Right. So I have a question yeah. like, uh, you know, I don't know if Broadway is trying to borrow a page from Hollywood, but is there going to be like a Percy verse on, on stage and then like Sea of Monsters coming next and then Titans <laughs> curse? Listen, I mean, I I would sign up for that in a heartbeat, yeah. but you know, you'll have to talk to uh, to Rick and to the, to the writers and producers on yeah, that one. So um, why should people, audience here in Northwest Arkansas, be excited about this show? What can they expect when they come to the theater to see you perform? Uh, oh, man. Well, first of all, the score is amazing. It rocks super hard. Um, so I think you, whether you're a fan of musicals or whether you're just a fan of rock and roll, I think you would get a, a big kick out of just the music. And I mean the vocals in the show, the rest of the cast, everyone's so talented. Um, I mean, it's definitely a challenge to sort of bring all of these crazy special effects to life, you know, like Percy, spoiler alert, is the uh, son of Poseidon. Right. So he what can- What, God! Uh, <laughs> I know. <laughs> you find out in like, you know, the first 20 minutes of the show. So okay, can't. all right, not a big spoiler. <laughs> no. Uh, and uh, so, yeah, so Percy can like control water. And so it's at one point, you oh, know, yeah. he like, causes a huge tidal wave. So they're like and guys back in backstage shooting squirt guns like a Gallagher well, show. A super soaker. So, <laughs> so what I'll say is we chose not to go the super realistic sort right. of Hollywood special effects route. So um, just seeing all the different insanely creative ways that, that we as the cast and the creative team came up with to, uh, to portray all of this crazy stuff that happens. Uh, it's a lot of fun. It's, it's a wild ride. It, so sounds like, would, think... it sounds like a lot of innovation and a lot of creativity, and I can't wait. Uh, Northwest Arkansas audiences can see The Lightning Thief at Walton Arts Center January 4th, 5th. Friday is at 7 o'clock, Saturday at 2 and 8. Sarah Beth, thank you so much for joining us to tell us about The Lightning Thief. It was a pleasure. Thanks so much for having me. Yeah. Stick around, folks. we got more coming up right after this. Yeah, welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. Later with Jason Sewell. Joining me at the desk, we got one of my favorite human beings in Northwest Arkansas. Whoa, big praise. I know, big praise. It's me. <laughs> this you are one of my favorite human beings. Oh. But uh, we got a different gentleman joining us over here. He is sort of our extreme sports expert. He's done a lot of work for us on the show. He's ripped. He is ripped. I can't wait to see what he does for us tonight. Please welcome to the stage my good friend, Turbo Dan. Yeah. Yeah. Give me some. Give me some. Right. I love also, you might notice Triple Dan being escorted to the stage by the amazing WAC volunteers. Kathy, thank you so much for bringing him out. Give me some, Kathy. Yes, yes. There it is. yes. The WAC the volunteers, cool they bags. do an amazing job here at Walton Arts Center, and you can find out how you can volunteer to be one of those folks at waltonartcenter.org. Turbo Dan, how's it going? It's going real good, Jason. How are you doing? <laughs> what are you wearing? Well, you know, I thought I'd dress up for the occasion. We're yeah. here at the Walton Art Center. I, you know, you can't just wear my athletic gear. No. I'm wearing art. You are wearing a cat who is surfing on a piece of pizza. Yes, I am. <laughs> yes, yeah. <laughs> And it's a romper. Also. It, it is. You know, Jason, I put on my pants one leg at a time, just like everyone else, except my shirt is always attached. <laughs> That is actually true, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so what's going on with you, man? The last time I saw you, we were doing some yoga at Lululemon in Fayetteville. What are you up to now? Yeah, well, uh, you know, I was, thinking of, I was thinking about it, and I realized that I've spent so much of my time trying to put my body into peak physical condition. Right. That, I, you know, I've really neglected my mind. Uh -huh. uh, and so, you know, I've been, I've been thinking that I've been trying. I, I, I want to do something. I want to do something in the arts. Oh, okay. No, I'm on oh, board God. with this. Yeah. So, uh, what are you th what are you thinking? Well, 
I've sort of been trying this method acting thing. Okay. Yeah, and I heard Cats is coming to the Walton Art Center. <laughs> it is, oh. by the way. So I thought, I, 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 you know, who better to play a cat than me, Turbo Dan? <laughs> right, totally makes I sense. I can think yeah. of about a hundred <laughs> So, you know, I've been, I've been eating the proper diet, doing the proper exercises, uh, you know, strengthening my voice, mm -hmm. that, that sort of thing. So, Tell me more about the proper diet to well, be an artist to audition for cats. Well, as a, as a method actor, you have, you have to eat what cats eat. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I, I really, I really enjoy some fancy feasts nowadays. You do? Yeah, uh, the fancy, the fancy feast is great. I really like the shreds. You got to eat the shreds to get shredded. <laughs> sounds, sounds legit. In fact, audience, would you like to see Turbo Dan try to eat some fancy feasts? Oh my! On I'm hungry. I'm real hungry. I'm real, real hungry. You hungry? Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh no! Here we way. go. Do you need a fork? Oh cats my don't God. Use yeah, fork. Cats, okay. cats don't Why use forks. Why is there forks. two cans? <laughs> Cause, because for you, cause, Jason. Cause I, oh my cause gosh, Because I'm, no. I'm real, real. That I'm gonna, for I'm you, real. Jason. You got to get on. All right, let's see. What do we got going on? We got turkey and giblets dinner. What's that one? Uh, this, is all, this is also turkey and giblets. Oh, it's Thanksgiving yeah. up in here. It, it is. Can I just, can I just put this on the desk? I, I just uh, eat it off the... We've already made a mess in here, so you <laughs> go for it. Do you need this? No, I don't need... You can eat... I've been doing this for a while, Jason. I'm not going to eat this. Yes, you are. You can do it. Okay. Only after turbo. Dan. On the count of three, we'll do it together. Okay. okay, are you ready? Yeah, ready? Yes. If I eat it faster than you, then I win. I'm just taking one bite. No, yeah, so just no, the... don't just, yes, we're going to eat the whole can, yes. Turbo Dan, mm -hmm. TD. You get yours. Ready? We'll get ours while you get yours. Can we do a countdown? Yes. Audience, can you count us down? We're going to go down from three. Three, two, one. Are you ready? Here we go. And three, it's going to be so fancy. Two, one. Yeah. No. <laughs> Keep going! Oh my god! He's so fancy! Oh. TD! TD! <laughs> this Here. is Let me help you. amazing. Let me help you. In the oh. Choo choo! Right in there. No. You, did no. it. you did it, man. We uh. ate it all too. Don't look over here. Yeah, don't look over here. Yeah, big round of applause. Oh. Everyone, go. The cattle diet. The cattle diet. Yeah, yeah. It's the keto diet, it's guys. A diet. It's a cattle diet. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everyone. <laughs> okay. Are you feeling better now? You said yeah. you were hungry. Yeah. Uh, hey, Andrew Lloyd Webber, put this guy in your show. Cats coming to Walton Arts Center May 28th through June 2nd for yeah. eight shows. It won seven Tony Awards. You've got to get a ticket for that. WaltonArtsCenter.org. Stick around. we got more crazy things apparently happening later. <laughs> From Harvest Moon. Yeah, pun. Wow. From Harvest Moon. Thank you, band. Awesome. Ben Harrison. Man, what's up? I'm on the show. Yes, Harrison. I have been wanting to have you on the show for so long. Don't lie. Yeah. I have, really. No, Ben's great. He's, yes. been, he's actually been on the show yeah. in an episode That's right. of Upbeat. That's which, right, he has, uh, yeah. yeah. Which is, uh, which Play is a bad guy. A I get to yes. hold a gun. I have That's a gun right. Yeah. right now as well. Oh, oh you do. Oh, Pag well. and heat, open carry. So if you don't know Ben, he's a student at Brightwater, uh, fans of Brightwater, Northwest Arkansas Culinary School. Give it Absolutely. up. Yes. You're also a chef at Harvest Moon Pies. Harvest Moon Pies, you can find them. They make the finest pies this side the of the biggest Mississippi River. That you can uh, get. And they're located Legally. right on College Avenue in Fayetteville in front of the old AQ Chicken headquarters in an Airstream uh, serving up fresh Wait, pies that was every day. AQ Chicken headquarters? Yeah. What are we making? We are going to make pie. Yeah, you told it. Uh, we're going to make a chocolate cream pie. This uh, custard will be able to be used in any pie, but we're. We're going with chocolate cream today, mm -hmm. cream. and we're going to have a lot of fun. We're going to start with the eggs. Uh, Jason told me backstage that he could juggle. Oh God, there's only four eggs. Are you going to juggle? How and we need, need two of them, can so you can drop two. Oh God, here we go. Hey. Yay! Okay, let's See, let's work quick. Work. Let's work quick so, to get this the shell out of here. Oh no. Did you hear the gas from the audience? Oh, like, oh my god, oh, he's gonna juggle. Ooh! 
It's oh, gonna happen. Thrills and chills. Actually, I'm later with Jason Sewell. I don't have yeah. a thing for the show. You can put it in Jason's mug. There you Should go. Work. <laughs> right there. Uh, yep. Would you like to? Uh, let's get hands on. Let's let's all okay, do yeah, something. Okay, yeah, stall. Pitch in. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, nice. Bam. So we started with two eggs. This is the binder. This is the binder. Mm -hmm. This is mm -hmm. what we're focused on here. Is the Got egg. It. Now we'll add the dry ingredients. Okay. So here. There's a lot of white powders. What do they all, what do they do? Uh, that one? Sugar. Not a yes! Lot this one. Is this a special one? Don't say that yet. Okay. Oh, sugar. Uh, sugar, three okay. quarters of a cup, and that'll three go right in there. Sugar. Flour. Ah. One third of a cup. Okay, nice. Right there. Wait. So you can use a whisk when you do this at whisk home. It. Or uh, you can let it whisk. You whisk can go it. the the more manly route. The more is manly that, is route. Is doing the more industrial route? No. What? And bring in a drill. Yeah. So Jason, please uh, be my guest. It is. A, it, it is. I think you want to be your guest. I okay. want you to be very careful. Ah. I want you to be more well, careful. You've been talking a lot tonight. <laughs> Just let it rip, dude. Have fun with it. <laughs> we will never be welcome again at the Walton Art Center. <laughs> Should we add another egg? Because I feel like... Yes! <laughs> More eggs! <laughs> That's insane that you've just done that. Thank you. This is live we TV, folks. Pie anymore. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're, we're just we're having just, fun. We're making a mess. We're not, we have two we have egg goo. and a half egg. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. We have three quarters cup of sugar. Okay. We have a third cup of flour, a splash of vanilla. It's mm -hmm. real vanilla, big dog. It's pure. And a little salt. Yeah. Okay. But I, there's half and half. And there's, there's chocolate powder. Yeah, Bo, I'm going to need you for that, actually. Oh. If you would pour three cups of half and half. And then it goes into the pot. Jason said I was not allowed to be near fire on this show. I did say that. So I can't actually heat it up, but I did bring the end product. The finished product. Okay. Let's see. So we, you we, want to cook this at a 180 this degrees for about 12 minutes. Okay. okay. On the stovetop, stirring constantly. And boom. And there it is. That's Pull it beautiful. out. They can't see it. It's a box. Yeah. Look at that pie, everybody. <laughs> That's how you do it. Yes. Ben Harrison, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for letting us run amok for a few minutes here on Later with Jason Sewell. If you're Get in the up. pie, you clean all this up. if you're in a pie, oh, no. you want to check out Waitress, the musical that's coming here to Walton Arts Center April 9th through 14th for eight shows. And did you know that the music was created by six-time Grammy nominee Sarah Bareilles? You can check more out at WaltonArtsCenter.org. Stick around; we got more Bareilles. happening <laughs> later. <laughs> Elaine James joining us from Elaine's Dance. Thank you so much for joining us on Lane with Jason Sewell. Is it so named after here. you? It's Wait. gotta be. Is it a different Elaine or is it this Elaine? You know, I just pulled it out of a hat. Got it. <laughs> just got the name that came I was out wondering of where the name came from, but now I got it. Yeah. Uh, Elaine, you've got some dances, dance classes coming up here at Walton Arts Center yes, where I people do. can participate. When is that happening? January 4th and January 11th. Right. Yes, 530 to 630 on the 4th. And the same time on the 11th. Yes. But then there's a band immediately after on the oh, 11th, the swing band. Nice. Hot Club of San Francisco. Whoa. Uh, oh, nice. nice. So you're going to have a party right after the last a class. Party. It's going to be so fun. You can dance around. That's amazing. It sounds like a lot of fun. Yes. So we have some volunteers again talking about the amazing volunteers here at Walton Art Center who are going to join us up here to learn a little swing dance. Can we welcome our WAC volunteers to the stage, everybody? <laughs> Let's get whacked. Let's get whacked. Sure. Yes. Yeah, get in here. Yes. Get in here, Bruce. Get in here, Jackie. Okay, Elaine, what do we need to know? Take us through. Can you teach us an easy swing dance step? Yes, this is the easiest step there is. Okay. Anybody can do this okay. dance. Anybody. So if you're going to be a leader, yes. typically a man, but it doesn't matter, start with your left foot okay. and step left. How simple is that? Easy. Right? <laughs> <laughs> and then you're going to add a left and a right. Okay. So you repeat those four steps I'm over and this. over and over. So left, left right, right, left, right. Left, right, left, 
Right. Left. I like it. Right. See? Dancing. Easy. I have a right. feeling it's going to get more complicated. <laughs> and then you do a headstand turn. And then you flip the girls. Yeah. yeah, right. I've already lost it. Where's my left? All right, what's next? OK, so you're going to stand in front of each other, your partner, leader, mm -hmm. follower. Ready? <laughs> Perfect. We're ready. We're good. Yeah, is it going to waste? Okay. Here we go. Yeah. yeah. OK, you can do two hands. Mm -hmm. Or you can do a dance break. Hey, 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 watch the Sorry, I don't know, we're just, we're lost in the moment. <laughs> Memory. Now, do you know right, left? Right, left, left, right, left, left, right. Right, left, left, left right. Yes. Right, left, okay. right. We're all good. OK, here we go. Right. And one, two, three, four. One, <laughs> two. two. Three, four. One, two, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's not just letting you kick anybody there. Let's try it over here. They're getting wild and crazy already. Hey, can we kick it up a notch? Can we play some music to help us move? Yeah. Those messing up our Oh, I like it. Okay, right. Three, four, one. Hey, Bo. Hey, Jason. Seems like at Sam's Furniture, they've got furniture from the window to the wall. Yeah. Is it just me or is it hot in here? Remember, get it at Sam's and tell them Jason sent ya. Yeah, thank you for joining us on uh, Later with Jason Sewell. We had a lot of fun with our live audience here at Walton Art Center. Give Ooh. yourselves a round of applause. Remember, if you're yeah, watching Walton out Art there, Center. you can find us on all of your social media platforms. You can even send us an email, which what? is one of your favorite methods Archaic, of communication. Like communication That's types. right. At laterwithjasonsewell.com. And before we leave this episode, we want to thank all of our amazing guests. Sarah Beth Pfeiffer from The Lightning Thief. Yeah. Harvest Moon Pie. Yes. Yeah. Our great friend, Turbo Dan. Yeah. All right. Elaine Dance. Yes. Elaine Walton Art Center volunteers. Give it up for the Walton Art Center, you guys. See you later, alligator. After a while, crocodile. Hit it. Let's go back. Thank you, guys. Wait.